Donald Trump is the president-elect and comedians are not having it. So here are the top five disses from late night TV. Hey guys, it's Emily for HollywoodLife.com and at number five, let's start with Jimmy Kimmel walking Hillary voters through the five stages of grief. No matter how you feel about it, Donald Trump is the president of the United States of America. So thank God we legalized marijuana yesterday. <laughs> Weed jokes, guys. At number four, Conan O'Brien is also trying to cheer everyone up and brought out his famous character, the really tall dachshund. Personally, the masturbating bear feels more on point. But anyway, at number three, Seth Meyers also sees room for optimism, considering he was wrong about Trump running, about Trump winning the GOP nomination, and about Trump beating Hillary. But the good news is, based on this pattern of me being wrong on every one of my Donald Trump predictions, <laughs> he's probably gonna be a great <laughs> president. <laughs> At number two, The Daily Show's Trevor Noah is in utter shock. This, this entire result is it's sort of like Trump's hair. I know it's real, but my mind can't accept it. It just, you know, because it, it looks like he's wearing his hair backward. Like everything, everything is backward. Making fun of Trump's hair always helps, but okay, at number one, I think Stephen Colbert sums it all up nicely. This is what it feels like when America's made great again. I, uh... <laughs> I was wondering, and uh, I was really hoping it would feel better because this sucks. All right, guys, that's our list, but I want to hear from you. Are you Team Trump or Team Never Trump? <laughs>